tonight uh, we're delighted to be celebrating our second installment of Persia After Hours uh, in collaboration with the Getty Museum here at the beautiful Getty Villa. Uh, it's uh, in commemorating a Pride Month and we have a wonderful uh, program put together uh, featuring uh, Farid Shafi Nouri who is going to perform a special concert um, dedicated to really Rumi called The Beloved and uh, we can't wait to share that with everyone and uh, we have uh, DJ Sean Nash spinning throughout the evening and uh, we have calligraphy artists performing and uh, doing demos and uh, we have more than 700 people who have RSVP'd for this event. It's a free event like all the events here at the Getty and we're delighted to uh, celebrate uh, Pride Month and the historic Persia exhibition with everyone. Uh, you know this is something we're so proud of uh, by Farhang Foundation to collaborate with the Getty Museum to present such an exceptional and historic exhibition and to have as many people as possible experience the beauty, the history, and uh, the impactful culture and art of Iran. Uh, we're delighted uh, with its collaboration and uh, we thank everyone for joining us. <laughs> Persia After Hours is a series that we're doing at the Getty um, in which we are highlighting contemporary Iranian performances in conjunction with our exhibition on ancient Persia. Tonight's performance is the second in a series of three and we've been working with Farhang very closely on all three of these performances. Um, it's been really wonderful working with Farhang. They really bring a good cultural sensitivity to the performances, uh, which is very important because authenticity is very important to the Getty. این برنامه بیشتر برای کالچر ایرانی هستش که نشون بدیم کالچر ایرانی چقدر وسعتش هست موسیقی ایرانی من خودم کار الکترونیک میوزیک میکنم کار هاوس میوزیک و دوست دارم که موزیک ایرانی رو با موزیک الکترونیک تلفیق بکنم تا نسل جوان بیشتر با موسیقی سنتی ما و کالچر ما بیشتر آشنا بشن چون تلفیقی از این دوتا میتونه که کم گوش بچه های جوان ها الانه به خودش جذب بکنه As you can see this is the Persian calligraphy and we do Persian calligraphy mixing the painting. We are using many different colors, the colors of the rainbow. And as we know, when we are looking at the rainbow, we can see many different colors, but we know that all those colors are illusion. And behind those colors, there is a ray of the light of the sun, which has no color and all the colors come from that. So we believe that this oneness can connect us and we are just celebrating many Persian culture here in Getty Villa and just to show the people in Los Angeles how beautiful is the Persian culture. We have art, we have many things, old uh, ancient uh, in the museum that people can come and visit and beautiful art from uh, my country. special uh, occasion for me to both work with uh, Farhang Foundation once again after all these years and this time at the Getty Museum, the Getty Villa, which is uh, a place that I've loved for many many years and to play music actually to be the second musician ever to play in their outside auditorium is something that I had been looking forward to and tonight we're uh, excited to share 
some good vibes with all, all of our friends and fans here in the beautiful city of Los Angeles. I've been working with Farhang Foundation since 2008 uh, when I had submitted uh, music in the, the music video festival back then and uh, it's been a wonderful pleasure to, to be with Farhang all these years and uh, it's definitely an organization uh, that I feel in the diaspora many people look up to it many artists are, are are benefited from it tremendously and I and I find it to be doing good work and obviously uh, if the artists are happy then everybody is happy well I think it's uh, of the utmost importance that uh, institutions such as the Getty actually supports us on a cultural level because oftentimes we're stuck in the cycle of politics and society uh, but when we when we uh, teach and share each other's culture then we begin to do true bridge building and I feel that this is part of uh, the journey in my world as an artist uh, an Iranian American uh, and the diaspora but more specifically to to have this level of support is a good sign and I'm, I'm very grateful and looking forward to, to more engagement such as this. It's an incredible honor to work with Farid, and um, I'm very grateful for the Farhang for creating this opportunity for us and uh, for the Getty Villa. Um, Farid is my artistic brother in art, and there is no other musician that I love working with more. Every time we come together, um, there is an incredible sense of harmony, of unity, that we both feel absolutely passionate about bringing the poetry of Mevlana to life in this moment in time, um, in this contemporary context. Um, I think we're both kind of radical dervishes and also straddling um, the contemporary world that we live in, contemporary artists. And um, yeah, tonight I really, um, pray that we set the stage on fire and that we really bring the message of Mevlana's poetry to life. For me, dropping into the miracle of this moment in time, the miracle and mystery of this body on loan, every, every time I dance, I um, embrace the idea of impermanence. And I think one of the deepest messages in Mevlana's poetry is, is being in impermanence and being absolutely um, without any blocks or shields to being in love with life, in love with each and every soul around us, with um, this universe, being in awe and uh, gratitude. So um, my dance is about this, is about stepping into impermanence and uh, dissolving my nafs, dissolving my ego as an artist, as a performing artist, and really um, being transparent. And I, I pray that I break open everybody's heart to this, um, this um, feeling of absolute love, of unity, of divine impermanence.